How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad... That didn't help. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. You from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force Base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. He's got a temper. Ah, fuck you. Yeah, he doesn't mean it. It's just that... Yeah? We've got kids here. Family. He and I are a family. I'm just saying some people can't handle a temper like that. Hell, barely seems like you can. It's just his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. Where's her mom? Savannah, I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Oh, and Lee? Yeah? It was a crazy situation, and you froze. Before, with that thing coming out of the bathroom? Uh, yeah. Just don't beat yourself up over it. We stick together, and we'll be okay. Pills are in there. There's no getting in there from out here. That grate does its job. It's not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. But here you go. Thank you. Of course. Hey there. Hi. Can I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. Still, huh? Yeah, it wasn't much. I know, Clem. I'll see if I can find something else for you. So, um... Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh... I'm good. That's good. Yeah, I think so. Uh, being good is good, despite the circumstances. Yep. Any word from Glenn? Nothing. Is he okay? Yeah, I think so. You're doing a good job. 
We'll sit tight. Okay. This battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. How we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Not now. All right. Hey there. I better get back to it. Yep. Try to get some rest, hon. How can I with those things out there? How are we doing? If you don't mind, I think my family and I are gonna rest for a bit. Let me know if that asshole over there takes a turn for the worse. You got it. Everything okay? Mm-hmm. It's not much but here for the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. doing good want to go have a look around outside let's have a look around okay one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Look at the one trapped over there. Better hear it us, huh? Oh, shit. What? Do you know that guy? He could be a drugstore employee. So you're saying he might have the pharmacy keys? I'm saying he might have the pharmacy keys. I don't know. Could be anybody, you know. They start rotting and get all chewed up and... Shut up, Doug. Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. <laughs> Too bad we don't have a way to come out here and watch the news. It would be nice to know what's going on elsewhere. Atlanta's in rough shape, and that's all I know. It's a combination lock. 
That place is full of TVs and electronics. We prove that that guy worked here, and then we can try to clear the street to search him for the keys. Yeah, probably easier said than done. so far. And the drugstore's safe enough, I think. Whoever owned it took good care of it. It's well stocked and locks up well. What's everyone like in there? Oh, well, Carly's pretty nice, you know. <laughs> yeah. Lily doesn't take any crap. She's been running the show, keeping people on watch, things like that. And her dad... Yeah, that guy. He's kind of a dick. Pardon my French. We should think about searching that guy across the street. Maybe he has some, but who knows if he actually worked here. Let's head back inside. Okay. Still looking for batteries for that thing. Thanks. I appreciate it. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Not now. All right. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. this door for when we find the keys. What's that? This is my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you when you had. My dad gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that.
Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. <sighs> How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we go. Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? Let's not talk about that. Do you play sports? I play soccer, but I don't really like it. I'm not crazy about it either. All right, a little further. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? I hope not. It's just complicated, that's all. Why? It just is. But you love them, right? Yeah, of course. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen, and we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find you a bandage. There's a band-aid in there, I bet. Oh, good. Get the remote for that thing in here someplace. Lee? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll, uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? It's the remote to my dad's TV. That's what I figured. That's what I figured. Everyone out there seem all right to you? Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. I was scared. Yeah, I was far away. That lady saved me. I'm glad she did. Maybe stay closer next time, so you're not so far away. I'm gonna try. Good. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. Pants came in here hoping to survive, but it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. There's a photo over there.
find anything? It's a photo of the family who owned this place. It might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? No. I've been sticking to first names for a reason. Well, good. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. How can I trust you? You can't, I suppose. But you don't have many other options. came in here hoping to survive, but it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <sighs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. Let's have a look at that finger. How? It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. <laughs> 